The only way to predict the future is to create it. And that time is now. Climate restoration. It's the biggest thing we're not talking about. And it's the missing part that can help return CO2 and our climate back to levels last seen over 200 years ago. Climate restoration makes a whole lot of sense, first of all, because it's win-win, you know, healthier ecosystems, a healthier environment, uh, a better planet is obviously better for us. Climate restoration means uh, getting the climate back to levels that humans have actually survived long term. We've always had the information needed to save the climate. All we had to do was less of what we are doing. But we didn't. We did more and more until we got to where we are now. Achieving net zero is an essential step, but it won't save us from the ever-growing climate catastrophes. It's clear events are overtaking us. Seeing uh, some of the hopelessness uh, that the youth have, have shown, they're really incredulous that we haven't done more already and that we've let it get to this point, that we do it under the auspices of preserving the economy rather than realizing that the planet that we live on is the only way we're all going to survive. People suffering the most from climate change usually have the least to say in charting the response. Well-meaning people come in with, we have all of the answers. Instead of really leaning into the work and saying, I need to first understand a problem I'm trying to solve, which is empathizing, meaningful consultation, gathering those facts. But no matter who you are or where you come from, we all deserve a place at the table when it comes to deciding the future of our planet. Organizations like F4CR are bringing together and connecting everyday people with education, advocacy, and solutions. The eco-anxiety that people feel is very widespread. And uh, what alleviates that better than anything is taking action. It was like a nickel dropped, and I got that we can do it. It's like the moonshot. Science and solutions to address climate restoration are available now and are being developed to become scalable, permanent, and financeable. Permanent CO2 capture, converting it to aggregate for carbon-negative building materials. Ocean permaculture, using seaweeds to permanently sequester carbon. Ocean iron fertilization, promoting plankton growth, which sets in motion a carbon capture cycle. An enhanced methane oxidation, converting this dangerous gas to carbon and water. We made it to the moon and back in 10 years using 1960s technology. So what makes us think we can't return our climate to sustainable pre-industrial levels? This is our Earth shot. Climate restoration with climate adaptation, emissions reduction, and all our scientific, technical, and financial resources. We can do this, and we can't settle for anything less.